Hey guys, I am back with another video here, and this is actually take two, so I was recording this, I was about a minute into the video, and somebody came by my house on like a car or motorcycle or something, and like, just revved the engine like really loud, so like, I didn't want that in the video, so I just decided to restart, and I'm currently recording this video on a Tuesday, on Tuesday, and... It, tomorrow morning, Wednesday morning, like real early in the morning, like before the sun comes out, it's supposed to like snow a lot. We're supposed to get like four inches of snow here. So I may or may not be uploading it Wednesday. So I'm not exactly sure when it's going to get uploaded. But like I said, it's going to snow and I might be out of school for like a couple of days. And I normally upload the videos while I'm at school because... It just takes forever to upload, and it kind of makes the internet slow, so just, since nobody's here anyway, I just upload it while, nobody, while I'm gone to school. So, that's enough of that stuff. So I got two DVDs, two Blu-rays, and one book, and I'm going to go ahead and show you the one book I got. And that is Pokemon the Movie 2000. The, the, this is just a um, novelization of the book, I mean the movie, I guess. It was 25 cents, and I, I like Pokemon, so I thought this would be kind of a cool little collectible thing. There's the back, and it looks kind of dark, like the pages have been faded a little, not faded, but like, just they're just old because the pictures are starting to turn. That old book color, or whatever. Haven't read this, but I I might read it. I'm not sure. They have just some pictures and stuff. I'm not gonna go too into detail, but yeah, that's pretty cool. Okay, next up, I've got the two DVDs I'm gonna show you. And first up is Star Wars: Attack of the Clones. Now, I do not like like I I want to say I do not like the prequels for Star Wars, but I can't really say that I don't like them because I haven't seen any of them all the way. I mean, I've seen Phantom the Phantom Menace all the way through, but I haven't, I didn't really pay attention when I watched it, so I don't really count that, so I just, I decided to get them. They were $1.99. Well, this was $1.99, so I went ahead and got, got it, um, you know, I did, I just, I did, I don't know. I, I might like them if I watched them. I just, they seem kind of dumb to me. Like, I mean, I know some people like them, but I'm just, I love the original three. Like, I mean, well, I don't say I love them, but I think they're really good movies, and I do enjoy looking at them. So, yeah, I just decided to get this so I could give these movies a try. I do have the first one on VHS. Well, the Phantom Menace. There's the back. There's the head. And then not only did I get that, I also got um Star Wars three, Episode three, um Revenge of the Sith. Haven't seen this one either. They act, I actually they had Phantom Menace the same version, like full screen or whatever, but it only had it didn't have the flipper tray in there. Disc one was only in there, and it people obviously whoever had it obviously knew that movie was shit, so they like scratched it, like put it on concrete and like rub it around and destroy the disc. So I didn't get that one, but if it was, if it was in good condition like these, I would have got it. But there's disc one. Two and the little insert, and I, I wanted to get these movies on Blu-ray. I was gonna get them, but for some reason, like my cousin has these versions. I don't know if his are the full-screen versions. They might be the widescreen versions, but he has these movies like this, and I've seen his copies and stuff. And I just, I just wanted them like this. I don't know why. But, like, I just think these, like, look cool together. Like, all of them together look cool, so, yeah. Okay, next up are the two Blu-rays I got. And if you're following me, you can follow me on Instagram if you want. I'm not trying to be that guy. So I don't post that much on Instagram, but I occasionally put stuff up there. 
But if you want to follow me, it's Kelso1999, nine, I believe, with like one extra nine. If not, if, if if it's not that, it's just Kelso1999, like my, um, not my YouTube channel, but I think it was like with 1999, nine, like one extra nine. So if you want to follow me on Instagram, you can. Like I said, I don't put that much up there, but you still can, because I occasionally put stuff up there. But, if you, like I was saying, if you did, if you are following me on Instagram, you saw these two things already, because I just put them up there, because I'm kind of getting into that. But, um, first up is, um, Batman and Harley Quinn. I watched the Teen Titans, I believe, the Judas Contract, and I enjoyed it, so I got this one, because this one was the next one was on here. I'm assuming on most of them you can't really see it, but it says a sneak peek at the next um, DC Universe animated movie, and and it had this one listed as the next one, so I just got it. There's the disc. I mean, the front and stuff. Basically the same. There is the disc. And then... There's the other one. Here is this. If you want to use that. If you want to talk about it. Which you totally can't because it's... I just realized it was out of date. But if you still want to try that, you can. And then... Okay, yeah, you can use this one. This one's not it. I mean, this one's in date, so I guess you get a digital movie on, like, Ultraviolet or something. Well, yeah, you can use that if you want, so I'm not going to use it. And last, but definitely not least, I got It, the 2017 remake. And I personally really love this movie. I mean, I, I, I mean, uh, it, well, this is like one of the one cases which I think where I think this one, the remake, was like better than the original, in my opinion. I mean, it wasn't really this one wasn't none of them were really scary to me, but this one was like really funny. I don't know if that's like a bad thing, but it was like more funny than it was scary. Scary. But I highly recommend this one if you like horror movies. Or if you like, like, Stand By Me, which is my favorite movie, or Super 8, or The Goonies, or something, I think you'll enjoy this, because it's kind of like about a coming-age movie bit, kind of. And then, here's another digital code. I'm not going to use it, because I don't do that. Well, I have used them before, but just don't really do that no more. Okay, so that is pretty much it. Be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe, and talk to you later. Bye.